So the first one is, would you rather live your entire life in virtual reality where all your wishes are granted or in the real world? Well, if you were to live in a life that's virtual reality and all your wishes come true, life would be pretty pointless really because you wouldn't really be able to view it from both perspectives as in life without wishes and life with wishes. But in the real world, as rubbish as it can be, like with like loads of like like the global arguments kind of thing like the whole eu situation as much as these things happen it is part of life which yeah which can be kind of rubbish sometimes so as much as it would be cool to have all your wishes granted i'm going to get the real world the next question is would you rather be alone for the rest of your life or always be surrounded by annoying people straight away be alone for the rest of my life because annoying people drive me up the wall i can barely tolerate them let alone be surrounded by them all the time would you rather be the first person to explore a planet or be the inventor of a drug that cures a deadly disease straight away inventor of a drug that cures a deadly disease i have no interest in I think it's astronomy and planets at all i don't know why it just doesn't interest me at all so straight away cure for a deadly disease would you rather be completely invisible for one day or be able to fly for one day being invisible you wouldn't be able to do very much being able to fly that'd be quite cool because you can literally probably go anywhere in the world that you want and it's free you wouldn't have to pay to cross the borders or different countries probably and um yeah you'd actually get to go wherever you want and if i was to fly i think the first place i probably well i live in england however i would probably the two places i would probably go is london and paris because they are my two favorite places ever would you rather be locked in a room that's constantly dark for a week or a room that's constantly bright for a week well, I can sleep in the dark and the bright, but I don't like the dark, if that makes sense. Like, it's when I'm asleep, I have to be able to see my room, because I'm always scared that there's going to be someone or something there. So at least I'm aware there is something there. So if it's bright, I'll be able to see constantly. See, I'm going to go for if it's bright for a week. Would you rather live without the internet or live without air conditioning heating? As hard as this is probably to believe, I could probably live without the internet because as much as I'm always on it, like I use it to upload these videos, I'm always on to I'm a I'm always on Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, Facebook, although Facebook is my least favourite social media. Um and I don't really play many games that use up the internet. But the thing is, I'm always either really hot or I'm really cold. So probably living without the internet would probably be better for me. Would you rather be able to teleport anywhere or be able to read minds? For this one, I probably pick be able to read minds because I think it'd be quite cool to be able to see what people are thinking when they're talking to you. Like, do they actually care or are they basically just like, being miserable inside their head while trying to seem happy with the conversation that they're having with you would you rather be able to control fire or water i don't like water i hate the taste of water the only time i like water is having a shower bath or going swimming however fire is cool it has like all these cool colors and um and i like the heat so i'll probably have to pick fire because then think of it this way, if you have to control fire, would you rather have unlimited sushi for life or unlimited tacos? Tacos, tacos for life, I don't know how to say it. Um, I don't like sushi, I don't like fish, I don't like rice or anything. So I'd probably have to pick unlimited tacos or tacos, although I've never actually tried one before I don't think. But they do look nice. Would you rather give up watching TV or movies for a year or give up playing games for a year? 
all I'm ever doing is watching Netflix and YouTube. So on Netflix, I'm currently watching Fresh Prince of Bel Air, uh, Once Upon a Time, Waiting for Pretty Little Lives to come out, and I've started watching this Thirty Reasons Why, which everyone's going on about at the moment. I, I mean, the bit's good, but I don't think it's worth the, like the big massive hype everyone's going on about. Um, so yeah, I'm always constantly watching those. So I'm not on my Xbox all the time, so I can't, and I'm never really playing my games anyway. So I'll probably live about games for a year. Would you rather never be able to drink sodas like Coke again, or only be able to drink sodas and nothing else? Well, if you counted fizzy flavoured water as soda, then soda is all I ever drink. Because I don't drink water, I don't like water. I do drink like Coke and lemonade, but that's on the rare occasion. I mostly drink my fizzy flavoured water. Because, I don't know, I just don't like, like, after all the treatment I had, it's put me off like, juices, water, like, just everything makes me feel sick. Like, same for fruit, they've got like, the only fruit I like are melon and strawberries mainly. I don't like grapes, don't like pears, don't like, don't like anything really. I hate, I think the worst one for me is oranges. It makes me feel so sick, the smell. And the last one is, would you rather be an amazing painter or a brilliant mathematician? Well, if I had to pick one for my GCSEs, it would be a brilliant mathematician, because at the moment I'm rubbish at maths. <laughs> However, amazing painter, that would be quite cool. So if I had to pick GCSE-wise, if I could have this for my GCSEs, it would be a brilliant mathematician. If I could pick one for life, I'd probably pick amazing painter, because I don't know, I think art is quite cool depending on what it is and who painted it so yeah they are all 12 questions of my would you rather terribly sorry for forgetting the camera and basically not well i don't have any music background anyway but so that was the end of the video i hope you enjoyed it if you did give it a thumbs up and subscribe with the red red subscribe with the big red button and comment in the comments future videos you'd like to see and i'll see you on the next one